Every two years, Woodmiser holds the popular Personal Best Contest, which gives Woodmiser sawmill owners an opportunity to showcase their dream projects. In each and every Personal Best project, there is a common bond. They all started with a dream and a Woodmiser. Never allow your need to make money to exceed your desire to provide quality service. This is the life mantra of Lynn Davis from Brookhaven, Mississippi. The 70-year-old Sawyer owns a 1998 Woodmiser LT40 Super Hydraulic and truly has a servant's heart. During the 2013 Personal Best Contest, Lynn Davis won first place in our Goodwill category and touched the hearts of many with his dream of helping a community in need. Lynn's Goodwill story starts in Mississippi, but ends 740 miles and four states away in the small town of War, West Virginia. As an active member of the Macedonia Baptist Church, Lynn and fellow church members became involved in a food mission that would help the small West Virginia community. This area, located in the Appalachian Mountain Range, was once a thriving coal mining region. For many residents, covering the basics of life, including groceries, presented challenges. With a high number of people willing to serve others, Lynn Davis and a team of volunteers took the call and organized the effort to build the War Food Distribution Center. With donated southern yellow pine and poplar, Lynn volunteers sawed all the lumber needed for the building on his Woodmiser LT40 Super Hydraulic. After all the lumber was ready for construction, the group traveled on the 11-hour journey from Mississippi to West Virginia to help this community in need. Even a roadside breakdown didn't stop Lynn and his team from helping the community. According to Lynn, this project began as an idea to solve a humanitarian need. It developed into a doable dream and ended with the satisfaction of reaching people that we did not know and helping them to have a better life. During the week-long construction, building everything from the floor joists to the roof trusses and raising up the walls, along with the lunches outside and enjoying the fellowship of the volunteer team, the building was completed. With nearly 400 square feet of space to sort, shelve, and fulfill the community's mission to feed the hungry, Lynn and his team enjoyed every step of the way. Lynn has made helping others a way of life. It's not about the money. If you see someone in need and you've been blessed with the means to help, then you don't have a choice. As for Lynn's next Goodwill project, he says, I'm on the ready. 